welcome back to my channel. This is Stephanie. I'm also known as Glissy Gem. Thank you for joining me here today. Hope all are doing well. Thank you for being here. For those who are new to my channel, please subscribe with the notification bell. Also, give my video a thumbs up. Those who are returning subscribers, welcome. Thank you for being here. And um, today we'll be doing an unboxing or an unbagging of my glam bag, Ipsy, my Ipsy glam bag. So we finally got our Ipsy glam bag. I know it, it took forever. Um, it seems like our mail has been coming you know, pretty late, you know, so late in the game. So here we go. I know I had some add-ons and I think that's why this, uh, this envelope is pretty big, but I still like the gradient color of the bag. I got think it's very colorful and it's not boring at all. So, um, I know I have some add-ons in here, so that's why the envelope is pretty huge. I think I already said that. All right, so let's open this up. Okay, so here we go. This is what's inside my bag. Has another bag in there and, and extras. So here's another smaller bag. Wow. Okay. And also have some some ex, some more stuff in here. Some extra things I purchased. So let's go through my bag. So I think we had pretty good choices for glam bag uh, for this month. This month of January, we had some pretty good choices. Um, not so much for the boxy charm. You know, I think boxy charm kind of lacked in their choices you know so but the glam bag had pretty good choices i really did like the choices that they had let's go ahead and open this up i'm pretty sure the glam bag's in this small little baggie all right Oops. okay so we have our little card so hopefully our card tells us what's inside the bag Yes, it does. It's Glow Your Soul. That is the theme, Glow Your Soul. So, yeah, here we go. Let's look at what's inside this bag. So this is our bag. I think the bag is really neat. It's really pretty. And I even thought of it being pretty when I first seen it on my account, you know, letting me know, you know, when you choose your product, it lets you know what bag is gonna come in. And it came, it came in this nice, pretty lavender shaded bag and it's made out of velvet <clears throat> it's a velvet bag and I let, it's re very pleasant to the touch and it has some sequence on it it has it almost looks like the color of the bag but it, it only reflects the color of the of the lights that it's giving off but you can also see uh the reflection of the color of the of the bag and the lights and then um what's all over what's all around it you know um, it's the multicolored sequence colored sequence. It's multicolored. It's not the clear. Um, that's the kind of tint it has, like the rainbow aurora borealis type of color to the sequence. And it's just the right amount of sequence. It's not. It's not a lot. Um, yeah, I think I think it's real pretty, real lovely, real. Um, yeah, real pleasing. I like it. Then it has the silver hardware with a silver zipper and it has the you know the logo ipsy on the zipper and it's the round one so you just open this up and the inside is it doesn't have the ipsy tag in it it's just the regular generic you know what is that fabric it's just a regular you know waterproof i don't know if it's waterproof fabric it should be like waterproof i think leak proof fabric i think it should be and then, so let's go ahead and open this up. So we first see the Aceology Berry Glaze Overnight Lip Mask. So we all know what a lip mask does. And it has a seal on it. And I'm not going to open it because I already have a lip mask. You know, I'm trying to, you know, I'm trying to get rid of the products that I do have before I get into a new product. So yeah, this doesn't feel like it's, it's pretty full either. And it does, I think it does have a seal. Yeah, it has a seal. So... Yeah, the product, I'm telling you, if I squeeze the product all the way down, I think I'd get about, I think I'd get about this much product only. Like from here to the bottom. And we're still missing a lot of product up here. So that's what they gave me. That wasn't my choice item. That's what they gave me. <clears throat> and if you get the full size version, it's... Um, $19 and it's 15 milliliters. That one is 0.17 milliliters. It's a deluxe sample. So we have one deluxe sample. All right, the next thing we have here 
is the uh, First Aid Beauty. It's the First Aid Beauty Deep Cleanser. It says with red clay, it helps remove excess oil and unclogged pores, safe for sensitive skin. So usually um, First Aid Beauty always has the colloidal oatmeal and that's supposed to be very soothing to skin that, that's very itchy. So it has a good, you know, it has some good ingredients. Let me see if this one has that colloidal, colloidal, colloidal oatmeal. Sorry, it's kind of hard for me to pronounce. <laughs> uh, let me see if it has that. So this doesn't seem to have colloidal oatmeal, especially I guess because it's a cleanser. So I guess it being a cleanser and has red clay, um, it doesn't have colloidal oatmeal. I think it don't, it's only seen in their like moisturizers. You know, in creams, you'll see the color oatmeal, which is, um, which like I said, um, I'm glad it doesn't have it. So I will be keeping this to try it out because I've, I've always wanted to try First Aid Beauty, but I, you know, I'm sensitive to that one ingredient, but this doesn't have that ingredient. So I'm very happy. So how's everybody's day going? I mean, um, how's the weather? Is the weather still pretty cold, pretty chilly where you're at? Because it's still pretty cold over here where we're at here, down in the south, here in Texas. Um, as you can hear my voice, it sounds kind of kind of hoarse, but um, yeah, I, I can feel it. <laughs> so here it says that the full-size version of this product is 4.7 ounces at $24. And this uh, deluxe sample is 1 ounce. So not bad for a deluxe sample. 1 ounce is not bad for a deluxe sample. And you know what I'm I'm noticing that I'm appreciating now more? They stopped giving us those little bitty tiny small sample sized products, you know, uh, like they used to. And now they're giving us more bigger deluxe sample size product. And I and I really do appreciate that. Because before, man, they were like real little. It's like, uh, I don't think it was becoming worth getting the, the glam bag. But um, I was impressed with this month's glam bag. So... <clears throat> So that's another deluxe sample. All right, so let's go to the next ones. Next one that I have here is uh, the Dido or Ditto or D2 or Dito. Uh, D2 or Dido. The Voile Lasting Makeup Fix Mist. And I like the I like the packaging. It looks like a capsule. And I know you can't stand it up like this because it'll just tip over and fall. So I think the best way to stand it up is just tilt it upside down. Hopefully it doesn't leak, but it has a little protective, it has a protective cap. So if it does leak, it'll leak in the cap, unless it leaks on the outside, but I doubt it. So yeah, this is holding up pretty good. We do appreciate that. But once you start, once you squirt and you get product inside the squirter, chances could be that it can start leaking if you have it upside down like this. So maybe just let it, lay it like this or I don't know for now I'm just gonna lay it up lay it down like this you know with the cap down and so I can read more about this product so it's a it's a setting spray of course for makeup and their motto for it is called set it and forget it which is pretty cool it's pretty cute you know that that motto and <clears throat> we all know what a setting spray does and then for the full size version of this product, it's 50 milliliters and it's $19. This one is, how many milliliters? This is, um, this is 0.01 ounces. So it's, oh, 30 milliliters. So 30, 40, 50, yeah, like 20, milli, 20 milliliters off from, from the actual full size version. Version. Sorry. Um, yeah, for $19. So that's so, yeah, so this is almost like the full size. Just, a, just a, like, just a little bit smaller, you know, than the full sized. All right, so that's another deluxe sample. The next product we have here, and that was chosen for me. I didn't choose that. The next one here is a uh, we have the YC Collection La Parguera La La Parguera Island Eyeliner La Parguera. So this is a full size and it has a little smudger tip at the end. 
you know, and then the eyeliner is on the inside. And it is, it's an eyeliner, but I think it's like a cream, like a creamy liner, almost like a gel liner. So I don't think it's liquid. It's not liquid. No, because when I looked at it, it's not liquid. So it's supposed to be like this nice lavender shade, almost matching the bag here on the card. You can see that there. See on the card right there? Yeah. That's how it's supposed to be like that purple lavender shade eyeliner. It's supposed to give you like a shift. It, I think it shifts, you know. Um, let's, let's read what it says. Um, swipe the pencil across your waterline for intensified eyes. That's much to create a smoky look. So it doesn't say anything about it. It's supposed to be like duochrome or like it's like it shifts with, you know, to another color. It says this revolutionary gel eyeliner is a, is way ahead of its time. Not only does the smooth formula glide on effortlessly to enhance your eyes, but the multi-chromatic plum pen. So I knew it was multi-chromatic, you know, so I knew it had like some kind of like, <clears throat> You know like duo chrome or something it's multi-chromatic plum pencil also transforms into different shades depending on the lighting that's what I wanted to say I was like I know those are, are those eyeliners you know have like that duo like had that shift in color and that's what I really attracted me to the to the product I think duo chromes and multi chromes is what's in right now and um, yeah so it's a full size for $20 so that's a $20 pencil <clears throat> which is not bad because I purchased, um, when I did the add-ons, there were $350 in the add-ons, in the add-on store. There were only $350. So that's not bad. So that wasn't my choice item either, but I was glad that they put that in there. So overall, I'm liking the products that they gave me in my, in my bag. You know, really, I'm happy with it. Like I said, you know, the glam bag, the Ipsy glam bag for, the, for this month, for January, was on par. So the next and last item, which is my choice item which is the Lucky Chick, the Lucky Chick um, eyeshadow palette Daydreams. So it looks to me like, it looks to me like being like a berry colored type of color story. We'll see, we'll see if that's what it looks like on the inside. So, so far we had three deluxe samples, one full sized. And this is our last fifth item. This is how the packaging looks like on the outside. I mean, yeah, like that plastic, the hard plastic, glossy plastic. Oh, look at that. I was totally wrong. I thought it, I thought it had berry colors, but it has more neutral, neutral colors in it. And it has that one glitter shimmer in this, that one glitter um, sh shadow in there. It's not... It's not a shimmer. The shimmers, there's about one, two, three satin shimmers. So the shimmers are these two down here. There's satin shimmers down here. The lavender, and we have like a like a taupe. And then we have this one here in the middle at the top, right above the, the glitter at the top. So I think I'm going to put this palette in the giveaway. I know it, it was my choice item. I just, I don't know. I guess... I, I don't know I guess I have a lot of palettes like this and um, I didn't know what the color story I mean I think it showed us the color story it did but for some reason I don't know I, I just felt like maybe it would be something that I would wear but I think I'll be putting this in a giveaway so this is the full size guys this is like what is it like maybe four inches four inches maybe all around square and it's twenty dollars. This is twenty dollars. I don't think I'd pay twenty dollars for something like this, um, unless it has to be really good, really good brand. Um, I might just put this in a giveaway, or I might just try it out and see how the how the formula wears because I do like to review products. And if this is twenty dollars, I want to see if I'm getting my money's worth. You know, paying twenty dollars for this for this palette because. Um, the shades, the the pans, the sh the shades and the pans and the shades, you know, they kind of look. It's like, uh, they just they just don't look like they're, you know, the formula is there or it's on par to like for a twenty dollar palette, but you know, um, 
you know, it's not nothing bad. It's just, I wouldn't pay $20 for this, you know, to be honest. So, um, so we'll do a video where I maybe do a try on, or I'll just probably just put this in a giveaway. I'll just straight, just put it in a giveaway. It all depends how I feel, <laughs> how I feel that day. All right. So that is everything in my Ipsy Glam bag. Um, also I did have some, some add-ons. So let's go ahead and check out the add-ons that I purchased. First off, I really had to get me, um, oh, the viral. This is the Tea Time Peony Tea Glow Oil. Oh my goodness gracious. I, I fell in love with Biro. And, um, see if you can. Yeah, so I fell in love with Biro. Can you see that? In the packaging. Yeah, the packaging seems kind of like blurred because of the color, the color effects of it. So. This is the Barrow New York Peony Tea Glow Oil. And I love peonies. I love the smell of peonies. It's a prime smoothing glow. So it's a two-in-one facial oil and primer supercharged with peony, vacutrol, and glutathione, glutathione, thione for luminous skin and makeup. Wow. Um... So I never tried this before, so I'm reading the directions. You warm up a few drops in the palms of your hands, and apply over the face, neck, decolletage after cleansing and before or after moisturizing. All right, almost like a serum. Almost like a serum slash, you know, extra, extra product to add to your routine, like a primer. So let's open this up. Oh my god look how beautiful the packaging looks like guys look at that pretty pink I love that pretty pink look at that it smells really good uh it does have that peony smell it does have that peony scent smell make it sound like it sounds like smell like it like stinks no, it's it smells it smells like peonies, and it's a very lightly fragranced product to wear, and it's pleasant. It's not a it's a pleasant scent. It's not at a, I'm not getting put off by the scent, and I'm I'm happy. I'm happy. I think it was worth my money. You know, well first I have to try it. First I have to review it and try it first, of course, and let you know how I feel about it. But as far as I know, I love viral products, and I think I'm gonna be very happy with that product. So. The next thing I have in here, you know, um, I'm not sure if they gave me everything that I ordered. I hope they did. I'll ch I'll go ahead. I'll go back into my account and check if they did. Now we have this Oriza Beauty Sun Kiss Baked Opaline Highlighter, and this is a full size version. This is the one. This is whenever I was looking for, you know, hidden gems, you know, in um, in the 350 section. You know, when you get full size products, because this is a full size product. Now I got it for three fifty, and I think I don't know what they're what they're you know what they're going for, but this is this was I only paid three fifty. This is Oriza Beauty Sunkissed Baked Opaline Highlighter, and it looks pretty small, but this is the full size, guys. This is the full size. It's not the deluxe size. I read it there. It says full size. This is. Uh, 0.13 ounces, 3.5 grams. So I was like, full size? Yeah, let me get it. Otherwise, I wouldn't have grabbed it. But this is how it looks like. It still has some more plastic on it, but it's a really nice shade of highlight. Yeah. So, yeah, I'm, I'm happy. I'm glad that I got, I got this. I'm glad that I got that. So, this was $3.50. So the next product that I do have here is by Ren, Ren Clean Skin Care. Now, this is a Radiance Glow and Protect Serum, which this is the little example, but I purchased it because I have Ren Clean Skin Care that I haven't tried, but I'm about to, I, I, I think I'm going to start trying them out, trying to test them out. And this is a Glow and Protect Serum, so... I'm not sure if you're supposed to add this into your, I'm pretty sure you're supposed to add it to your skin routine, but 
is it like a primer like is this this the last step you know for your skin routine it says am and pm gently press with fingers onto a cleansed face massage in circular upward motions until fully absorbed if using an am please follow up with an spf skin type suitable for sensitive skin so store out of direct sunlight so I wonder if it has an AHA in it because it's telling you to put on sunscreen after putting it on. Then yeah, this is the this is like the this is like the beginning, like when you would you would put on your serum. This is what you would you would put on before your moisturizer. Uh huh. Let me see. I'm trying to look for the ingredients, guys. I'm sorry. I'm trying to look for the ingredients to let y'all know. If it's like an AHA or BHA, it's just clean to skin, clean to planet, vegan. It doesn't give me the ingredients. It doesn't give me the ingredients. So, so I'm assuming that it's just letting me know just to put an a SPF on because maybe my skin will be sensitive to the sun when I apply this without SPF. So I'm gonna listen to what it tells me in the in the, in the instructions. So, but yeah, I, I wouldn't mind trying that. I, I know, I haven't tried any Ren Skin, Ren, Ren Clean Skin Care, and I'm dying to try them. So, not, and I'm wanting to try them out. So I also, I actually got two of the baked highlighters. Two baked highlighters. They're the same color, the sun, the sun kissed one, and they were 350 and it's full size. And I also got a Gimme Lala mascara, which I also got another add on, you know, for the mascara for 350 because they're full size, full sized items for 350. Then I actually got me this uh, cream blush, um, it's called We Don't Know Her by G Give Them Lala, Give Them Lala Beauty. This we don't know her cream blush. So and it's it's pretty. I have a lot of cream blushes uh, for some reason. Um, I guess I wanted to stick with the theme of uh, give them Lala. This is how it looks like. It almost looks like there's like little marbling or some kind of like um, I don't know, like some settling there. I don't know if you can see that. Like a little settling in there. I don't want to touch it because uh, I might just put this in the giveaway, guys. So, yes, yes, you guys. So this is wonderful. I think I did get everything that I ordered that I asked for. I think I did. Was there something else I needed to show besides that? No, I think that was it. Yeah, that was everything. So thank you guys. Thank you for joining me here today, and I'll see you in my next video. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and hit the notification bell. And I really do love you all and hope you have a great and wonderful Tuesday. Bye!